nice sunny day nobody out here What's up guys, hope you're having a fantastic day as always. I'm out here with my Yamaha FZ07. Um, just went for a little ride with it. Uh, gonna go for another ride. It's a nice day out. I had to work all day, but I'm out here now and gonna join a little riding. <clears throat> Let's make sure this camera is recording. So, Get the kickstand up. Oh. talk about today um, one thing that really bothered me today when I uh, was driving to work such a shame that I had to go to work on a day like this but it happened uh, so I was driving to work and when I go to work when I'm almost there there's always this uh, gas station that I go by it's a uh, stewards gas station and so the price of gas was uh, $4.64 for regular per gallon. And I was just, uh, how would I say this, really disgusted by that because of uh, the ridiculousness of that. And, and just, I think in... Uh, in under a year and a half of him being president, the price of gas went up double, which is just awful. Thankfully, my bikes, uh, they don't take that much gas. Um, they take less gas than pretty much any car. Well, most cars out there. My new favorite bike that I have, uh, my Honda Valkyrie, that's like my new baby. Uh, I absolutely love riding that thing. But they say online that it apparently uses uh, a ton of gas, so for a motorcycle. I still have uh, yet to go to a gas station with that thing. thing this thing is a, a beast for a 700 cc engine yeah so in my opinion, it's totally ridiculous to have gas even be $4 a gallon. And now it's a, it's a record high for gas prices today. Today is, uh, I believe, May 11th. And it's a record for gas prices since like 2008, I think. Totally ridiculous, but what are you gonna do? The sun is uh, blinding me a little bit. I'm out here in the country. Wow, that'd be a nice road to go with a four-wheeler. I don't know if that's private property or or what, but oh, let's slow down here. Thirty mile per hour speed zone.
Oh, there's a paintball park here. I didn't even know that. Not that I'm gonna go, but. I had a uh, negative experience. <laughs> A few negative experiences with paintballing when I was younger, so I'm kind of not interested in that. The War Club. John Deere uh, wood thing. I love living out in the country. It's like quiet and nobody really ever bothers you. You can have a fire in your backyard. Over in uh, the city of Utica, my, uh, my parents' neighbors, they have like chickens and whatever. So they had a fire one day and I smelled the fire and sure enough like uh, five minutes after I smelled the fire the firefighters came and said oh you got to turn get that out turn that off but out here nobody's gonna bother you with that Over here, people have John Deere tractors, and what the heck is that? Some kind of a dome. Yeah, nobody really bothers you out in the country. I think there's a bug crawling around on my forehead or something. Let me put this bad boy in neutral. Nice sunny day, nobody out here. I just drove by this way, uh, this exact loop that I'm doing, except I went the opposite way, the total opposite way. And uh, it's crazy how I don't recall any of this, like uh, these logs I don't even remember. I feel like a bug went in my eye. Yeah, when I was uh, 21 years old, or 22, I got my first bike, and that was a Yamaha R6, totally 100% uh, a crotch rocket, and I really liked that thing. And then soon after that, I got a CBR 1000 for my second bike, and uh, nowadays, I'm in my 30s now, oh, that's a nice blue house. I'm in my 30s now and I don't really I don't really need the fast bikes like that anymore. Even even riding this bike, it feels like it's way too sporty for me. Man, that's a nice house. Look at that. Holy moly. Would I love to move over here? Three stall garage. That's a nice one too. Looking at these houses, I'm gonna fly off the road here. I mean, my garage is like medium size, but when you have a three stall garage, that's something else. Some 
kind of baseball game or something going on here today. I totally floored it. <laughs> well, I didn't floor it, but I overtook some car earlier. And uh, people probably stared because this is a loud bike. Yeah, man, everything about this bike seems sharp, like the handling, the brakes, literally everything, even the turning. That lady has poor vision, I think. Looking to the side while she's going straight. Just awful. But yeah, uh, what did I want to say? Everything about this bike seems uh, like tight and sharp. The brakes, holy moly, I just uh, slid my la back tire there. Everything seems quick and sharp compared to my big bikes, like my cruisers. love it I love it but I don't really drive fast with this thing back in my neck of the woods grass is getting a little tall pop this bad boy in neutral here such a little bike man compared to my cruisers it feels like uh, like it's just an engine and wheels like there's nothing else Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash that like button and subscribe for more videos. Catch you next time.